What's up, Leos? This is going to be your sun, moon, rising, and Venus. No, no, reading for March the 1st till March the 5th, 2022, my Leos. I hope all is well with you guys. I hope you're staying positive, protected, blessed, and prayed up, and keep your guards all the way up. All right, Leos? Leos, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. No, no. Spirit guides, my God, angel or angel ancestors, my God, I angel, Holy Spirit. What are the messages for the Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, North No. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, North No. Right? What are the Leo thinking and feeling doing? What are they up to? What are they going through? Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, North No. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus North No. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus North No. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus North No. One more time. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus North No. Let's cut. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus North No. Okay, we have a chariot. We have the Nine of Swords, we have the Seven of Cups, and we have the Tower. Okay, now this can be the past and a little present or coming back or whatsoever. So the Tower, we have the Tower, this could be a Scorpio, okay, or this could be you, all right, Scorpio energy, or this could be you. The tower lies, secrets coming out, being exposed. Someone's calling in on someone, reporting someone, making up lies, false accusations. You know, uh, I don't know if I said that right, but I said it. <laughs> but uh, someone is doing some sneaky, dirty shit. So whatever you've been doing, Leos and the dog will come out in the light. So this can be the past or the present or whatsoever. Don't get get mad, okay? It's more more than one Leo. All right. This is a general reading. If it doesn't resonate with you, don't make it fit. All right? But the tower means someone's being exposed for doing some shit. Okay? They has no business doing. Okay? So lies, secrets, gossiping, calling in, reporting, lies, betrayal, backstab, seven of cups, Scorpio again. You got Scorpio on your chart. Is sun, moon, rising, something, Leo? Spying. Someone's stalking and spying. Or this could be a Scorpio that's stalking and spying on you, Leo. Okay? But someone's stalking and spying, trying to see if something working happened. Uh, how did it go down? Someone, uh, nano swords. This could be Gemini card. Or this can be you. Someone is up worrying all night about something that they did. Mm -hmm. Somebody did some tricky, sneaky shit. And now they're stressing and they're worried, trying to find out what to come out. Like, what happened? Like, damn, someone's nervous. Like, what happened? I want to know. It's like you can't sleep. Anxiety. Nervousness. Worrying about what you did to someone, Leo, or what someone did to you. Mm hmm Yeah, we have the chariot, the police. This can be the police, the Department of Human Services, a somebody coming to somebody with some bullshit. With some bullshit. Now, this could be news about a new move, a new home, a new property, a new job, or a new relationship, or someone you probably haven't heard from or synced in a while, going to get in touch with you, going to call you, or this could be a soulmate or someone that you've been waiting for nine years for or nine months or whatever to come back to your life, to come back in your life. This is someone you've been waiting up all night to see. Okay, stressing, worrying. This could be a cancer, a water sign, or it could be any sign. Also, like I said, this could be the police as well. Coming to you, questioning you, asking you something. Leos, okay? So this is, it could be the past and the present or whatsoever, okay? Take it how you see it, how you feel it. Okay, um... Let me see. 
the bottom of the card, we have a death card. It says Scorpio, Hangman, okay, and we have, um, okay, yeah, the Hangman. The Hangman, okay, is like someone putting something on hold. It can be a relationship or a job. I don't know. Whatever you, your decisions, whatever you plan on doing, uh, it can be putting a hold on something in your life, stopping something, or it can also be delays, okay? Someone's trying to cause delays. Someone's trying to cause setbacks in someone's life or your life, okay? This is, death card means ending of something, ending of a relationship, a death, or something like that, all right? So, this could be something to do with a relationship you're dealing with, or someone's coming back, going back to the past, someone keep bringing up the past, all right, or, um, yeah, something is on hold. It can be a relationship that's on hold. Okay, someone planned to see you, supposed to come to see you. Things just didn't go right or whatsoever. But death card means somebody passing away. It's uh, uh, someone that ghosted you, coming back to you. All right? This could be someone leaving a family or, or just an ending to something. Okay? So those are the bottom of the card. All right, Leo, the devil. Ooh, Leo. What y'all up to, Leo? What y'all doing? Y'all dealing with a Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, or a Capricorn? Or you're dealing with a group of toxic, negative people? Very dark and demonic. Are you dipping in uh, dark magic, Leos? Someone's doing spell work on someone. Someone's dealing with a group of witchy, witchy, evil, wicked people. You can be in a... Uh, I, abusive relationship you could a very toxic relationship you in uh leo it can be with a capricorn virgo taurus or whoever okay but someone's in a, a toxic negative relationship the relationship is 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 it's no trust it's no it's no fun i'm put it like that okay it's no respect or whatsoever it's jealousy envy uh, going behind each other's back or going behind someone's back, doing some very deceptive things to someone or who whatsoever. Uh, a hate love relationship, uh, okay? It need to be breaking. I don't know. Like I said, this could be you, Leo. The devil pop right up. Like you can have Capricorn in your summer, rising, whatever whatsoever. Or like I said, you could be dealing with a Capricorn or you in this toxic relationship. You, you, it could be family members or a group of people around that's that's no good, jealousy, envy, or this could be you, Leo. But justice. Someone's going to get justice. Okay. Uh, someone haven't been fair. Someone haven't been right. This could be some type of legal situation. A group of people. I don't know who you work with or family members or a group of people just plotting against you, against you. It's toxic justice. So you could be wrongfully accused, how someone treated you, did you, Leo, or this is... Uh, I don't know, some type of legal situation you went through, you're going through. It can be domestic violence, abuse, justice, legal situation, I don't know if you're on parole, probation, house arrest. Someone could be getting out of jail, going to jail, or something like that. I don't know. Maybe you, you I don't know if you're talking to someone in jail or justice whatever is going on some type of legal situation justice someone's getting justice someone want justice over you leo or you getting justice over someone will of fortune that's a good card and it can be a bad card okay so this is like maybe you going to law school going back to law school some kind of uh You could be traveling, money, 
it could be some type of money lawsuit, inheritance or lawsuit. You could be suing some people, suing a company. Um, maybe someone cheated you, betrayed you, stole money from you. The will of fortune, like I said, this can be you thinking about traveling. Like you, you thinking about going back to school, taking up some type of career or skill training. Okay. Be careful about going back to doing negative things the way you used to be, Leo. Be very, very careful about that as well. Because someone wants to see you. Someone wants to see you stay the same. Or I don't know what that means. Or low vibration. Or you're low vibration now. Or someone wants you to be. Is someone trying to stop someone from moving forward? Because like I said, the will of fortune is someone justice. You're getting justice, will of fortune. That's good. Something's good happen. You went in a lawsuit case. Okay, maybe you might want to go out of town, travel, or whatsoever. And we had an eight of cups. You could be dealing with a Pisces, a water sign. This can be a family member, a friend. Or this can be you, but but someone's going through karma. Someone's going through some shit. It's like I told you, the will of fortune can be good and bad. Okay, so here we got the eight of cups. So, like I said, Leo, this can be you, or this can be a Pisces that you know. But someone's coming towards you, or someone's leaving someone. Someone's leaving a family, leaving someone, walking away from someone. Someone's going through karma. Someone's uh. Going through some bullshit. I don't know because how they did you, how they treated you. Or this could be you going through karma, how you treated someone, how you did someone, Leo. But someone's keeping secrets, hidden genesis, motives, and flaws, arterial motives. Okay. We got the moon, right? But someone's keeping secrets. Someone's not being honest and real. Someone's not being truthful. Someone's not telling every someone everything. Like someone's... Gonna hit rock bottom, or about to hit rock bottom. Or like I said, someone's coming towards you. Someone needs someone help, or this can be you. This someone could be homeless, out of a job, relationship. It's like this person go back and forth, do the same old, same old shit over and over and over again. Okay, someone's just going back and forth, doing the same stuff. We have the Queen of Cups. Okay. And we had a Ten of Pentacles. The Queen of Cups, this is a counselor, someone's grandma, auntie, a mother figure, or this could be you. Okay, someone got their back turned. They're just like quiet to themselves. This can be a case with a co worker or a family member, who whatsoever. Ten of Pentacles. Okay, I'm going to say this. From the way I see it, from the way it looks, it's like. Someone don't want someone to be with you. You can be, it could be a Virgo or Capricorn Taurus that's coming in the picture. This could be a soulmate, twin flame, or ex or family member, friend. But it's like a setup, a plot. Be careful, Leo, who you let in your energy, your circle, in your business, who you invite in your house. Because it seems like a plot. This council, Queen of Cups. Now, this Queen of Cups can be evil too, it's sneaky. You know, people have agendas now. People can pretend, you know, and shit like that. So you gotta be very, very careful. But I don't know if this person is sending this person to you to find out something about you. To betray you, to get some information out of you, but just just be very careful because you got scammers out here. Be careful, someone selling you something. Okay, uh, just be careful. Someone is not trying to come in and take your money, steal from you, take from you. Okay, this could be a family member, friend, or whoever, whatsoever. Just be very, very careful. Also, be careful signing your name on something, read the fine print. Make sure you know what you're reading and signing, okay? 
Also, it could be someone wants to come in and apologize to you or uh, uh, explain something to you, but it could be fake at the same time. So be very careful with that. Pretender, you know. Someone pretend like they want to, they like you. They want to get the, just to get some information from you to find out about you or to betray you. Or this is what you're doing to somebody. Someone's coming to you, asking you questions, or it's like someone's you talk you talking to someone about someone, or this could be a new love, someone you just met. Y'all laughing, y'all talking, or whatsoever. Four swords, some sickness and illness, Leo. You could be coming down with some sickness and illness. Be very careful. Relax. Okay, put on some meditation music. Uh, try to humble yourself. You could be dealing with some depression, uh, stress, some mental illness, mental issues. Okay, um, you need to relax. Time out, right? Yeah. Yeah, someone... Someone could be preying on someone's downfalls. That's from what I see. Like, I'm picking that up. Someone could be preying on someone's downfall. Someone can be stressing, worried over someone. Oh, yeah. And we had a queen of uh, wands. This is an Aries, a fire sign. That's you. This is you, Leo. You can be a witch. Someone's, like I said, someone's pretending to be something that they're not. Someone is wearing a mask, fake, phony, a pretender to be nice. But behind closed doors, they evil as hell, wicked, doing black magic, into dog magic, doing all types of spell work, evil shit to someone. Trying to cause sickness, wishing ill. Someone, like I said, can be dealing with some mental illness as well. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. We got the world call. We got magic. I mean, magician. That's <laughs> judgment. And ten of pentacles. So we have the world card. Someone wants to change somebody's world. This could be you, Leo, changing the world. You're trying to change somebody's lifestyle, happiness, or what they do for a living. The world oversees trips and money. Good luck in the palm of your hand. Okay, that's good as well. You could be manifesting. Okay, Leo, you could be manifesting love, money, good health, and good wealth. Prosperity, new opportunities, jobs, and stuff like that. Okay. Like I said, you could be a witch or a warlock or a wizard. You could be a practitioner. Or you can be going to a practitioner, a light worker. Okay. Like I said, you could be manifesting money, good things. Okay. You could be a magician or you could be going to see a Gemini and Virgo. That's a magician. Or like I say, you can be a magician or you can be going to see a practitioner, a witch or a high priest or someone like that. Judgment. Someone's judgment, judgment, judgment. Someone's calling someone out on their bullshit. Someone knows what you're doing, Leo. Someone knows what you're up to. Someone knows something. Judgment. You could be waiting on some type of legal situation, something that's penny. Some court case or something like that. Judgment. This got something to do with a family, ten of cups. Judgment. I don't know if it got something to do with custody battle, child, uh, child support, or uh, judgment. Someone wants to rekindle a relationship, family, re like your family reunion, or an ex, a lover, or something. Judgment. Someone's judging someone's family, trying to judge someone's family. That can be the, you know, as well. Someone's judgment. Someone's trying to judge someone's family, judge someone. <laughs> yeah. Like I said, this could be some type of uh, custody battle, family mediation, family, like court, you know. Yeah. 
So Leos, we have the devil card. Like I said, this could be you into some dog magic spell work with a group of people plotting. Uh, uh, you could be in a toxic, like I said, a toxic relationship. And like I said, we got this queen of cups right here. Okay. Either this person doing, giving you to send it someone an evil act. Someone sending someone negative energy. Someone sending someone an evil act. We got this queen of cups right here in the world. So like I said, someone wants to change someone's world upside down or something. Okay. So you could be coming into some money, Leo. Okay. So justice, like I said, someone's coming in to give you justice. You're going to have justice over some type of relationship or money, legal situation or whatsoever. Like I said, the magician. You could have manifest this person in your life, this Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, Leo. Okay, you could have manifest this person or this person could have manifest you through magic, love spells, all types of ritual spells. Okay. The four swords and judgment. Also, you might get some news about your health. Okay, be careful. Or someone's going around spreading lies, saying someone got something, just making up lies on someone. Okay. Yeah, so be very careful. Some sickness, some illness. Okay, you might get some news from your doctor saying something. Or it could be good news about good health or something going on, judgment. Or this could be someone going to jail. Someone could be getting locked up. Okay. Yeah, Leo, I don't know if you're looking at someone's family. Pretending like, I don't know, you're looking at someone move on, be happy, Leo. You're looking at another family, be you know, move on, be happy. Okay, you pretending like you happy for someone, Leo. <laughs> you pretending like you happy for someone's family, but you not. Or this could be an ex of yours. You pretending that you're happy for them, but you're not. Or a friend or a family member. Someone's wearing a fake mask. A fake, fake mask. Someone's like a sad. Give me more about the world card. Oh, shoo, shoo, shoes. Okay, let me put those back. Leo's. Spirit, tell me more about the world card. Spirit, tell me more about the world card, please. Come on, cards. Tell me more about the world card. What's the world card? Tell me more. Thank you, Spirit. Nine of Pentacles. So someone's trying to... Leo, someone's jealous, or this could be you jealous. Someone's jealous because someone's money look good. Someone, the nine of pentacles. Someone look good. Someone feel good. Someone smelling good. Money look good. Someone's feeling abundant. Someone's bonded. Very abundant with money or happiness or peace and joy or looks or beauty. Someone's looking at someone giving someone the evil act. Okay. Someone wants to change someone's beauty by doing spell work on them. Yes, doing beauty spells. Oh, my God. Really, Leo? You either got a cancer or a group of people, or this is you, Leo. Someone is jealous of someone's beauty, someone's looks, someone's money. <laughs> Oh, shit. What's going on? Give me more about the magicians. Spirit, give me more on the magician card, please. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Spirit, give me more on the magician card. Give me more on the magician card. Thank you, Spirit. Yes, yeah, someone's doing love spells. Eight of Wands. It could be a Sagittarius. You, someone's met. <laughs> Someone manifesting love, new love, or this could be a Sagittarius, an ex of yours or something. Someone could be sending someone telepathic messages. 
You could be connected to a Sagittarius Leo. Someone sending messages like psychic messages, telepathic messages to you. Yeah. Speedy news about love. Okay. So, yeah, this could be someone. Yeah, you could be dealing with a Virgo as well. So, or, uh, yeah, Gemini or something like that. <laughs> Someone's doing love spells on someone. Trying to keep someone from moving on. Trying to keep somebody with them. Someone's doing love spells and sex magic spells. Sex magic, sex, yeah, sex magic. Someone's doing love spells and sex magic spells on someone. Ooh! Oh, my God. <laughs> OMG, Lord have mercy. Okay. Give me more on the judgment card, spirit. Give me more on the judgment card. Okay. Thank you. I have the five of pentacles. Someone's feeling left out in the cold, unwanted, unloved, unappreciated, homeless. Someone's going through some sickness and illness, worriness. I don't know if you kick someone out, Leo, or this can be you feeling like this, stressed out, worried, going through some health problems, okay? Or this could be a Capricorn, a, a Earth sign, any sign. Someone's feeling hurt. You hurt them, or you, I don't know if you kicked them out, or something that you did, or this could be you feeling unloved, unwanted, feel like no one loves you, notice you. Or this could be someone that you know. It could be a family member, a friend, or who whatsoever. Okay. And we have the two of cups. This could be new love, a new person that's coming in, in your life. Okay. This can be a cancer sign, a water sign, cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, a cancer. Yeah. Yeah, someone's looking at you move on and be happy with someone else, or this can be you feeling this way. Give me more on the Ten of Cups, Spirit. Give me more on the Ten of Cups. Give me more on the Ten of Cups. We have the Page of Wands. So this is a Leo fire sign. Someone's coming in towards you. This can be this... This Queen of Wands. Is this the Queen of Wands? Yeah. So be very, very careful. Let me clarify it. But someone's traveling. This could be you traveling, Leo. Yeah, this could be you, Leo. You could be traveling. Okay. You, go, you know, going somewhere to go see someone out of town or whatsoever. Give me more on the page of Wands, Spirit. Give me more on the page of Wands. This can be about work. You could be traveling to uh, out of town for work, or you might have to move out of town to a job, a new job, or whatsoever. Work, money. Okay. This could be about money. This could be about a workplace, at a workplace, or something like that. You could be going to a job interview or something like that. As well. Okay, let me see something. How long I've been on this reading? Spirit, clarify the page of ones, buddy. <laughs> Give me more on the page of ones. We have the strength. This is you, Leo. Your spirit guides are with you. They're giving you the strength to move on. To you, you thinking you like you watching someone, thinking about someone, obsessing over someone. You going through some issues within yourself or with others. Um, like I said, I don't know if you. It's like you're keeping something hidden, like you don't want nobody to know, or you just not saying much, or you 
You watching someone, you're looking at someone, but you're not saying anything to them. You're looking at them. You're watching them. <laughs> you're not saying anything. You're keeping your feelings to yourself. You're keeping things hidden. You're not saying anything. You like uh, isolate yourself from this person or whoever. You know? Give me more on the strength card spirit. Let me see. Give me more on the strength card. What's the strength? Give me more on the strength card. Yeah, hiding something. I got the hermit. So you you could be suffering in silence as well, or you can loneliness, unattached, like I said, unattached loneliness, you know, suffering in silence. You could be working on something, keeping something hidden, hiding something. Someone's doing spell work. Like I said, someone can be. Yeah, this could be someone suffering in silence. You want nobody to know that you're suffering in silence. You're hidden. Something's hidden. You could be hiding something. I don't know. But anyway, let me do one more. So give me more on the Nine of Pentacles. Give me more on the Nine of Pentacles. So give me more on the Nine of Pentacles. Give me more on the Nine of Pentacles. Give me more on the Nine of Pentacles. Like I said, we got the chariot. So this could be about a move or someone's coming to see you. This could be a water sign, a cancer. Someone thinks you're beautiful. You could be going out on a date. Someone you haven't seen in seven years or seven months. Okay. Someone, so you might get a phone call from an ex or soulmate, a twin flame. Someone, you, like I said, you haven't seen in a while. Or you're going to get a, a phone call about a move, a new job, a new home, or a new relationship, or a secret admirer. Someone's coming to visit and see you. This could be a water sign cancer. Okay? Uh, Leo. So this is y'all sun, moon, rising, Venus, north, no reading, Leos. All right, guys. Stay blessed and smooches.